As you may know, on July 4th, the number one movie in America was not Indiana Jones. It was a movie called Sound of Freedom. It was about a Homeland Security agent who quit his job in order to save kids from an international marketing ring. It is the fastest growing international crime network that the world has ever seen. For Homeland Security, you know we can't go off rescuing Honduran kids in Colombia. You can almost hear the shrieks that this movie succeeded against Disney's movie, Disney. <clears throat> Here's an example of one of the enemies of truth, how they're spinning this movie. These films are created out of moral panics. They're created out of bogus statistics. They're created out of fear. You can almost see the white light streaming into the darkened corners and these cockroaches just being frantic. And with something like Sound of Freedom, it specifically is looking at QA concepts of these child trafficking rings that are run by the high-level elites. It's got to be so insulting to have somebody that has never risked their life to save these kids saying that this is all exaggerated. This movie is a true story based on a real person, Tim Ballard, the ex-Homeland Security agent. So it's very telling to see who's coming out of the woodwork to try to attack this as some sort of conspiracy. They're trying to connect it to some conspiracy when in fact, like you said, this is a true story. That's Tim Ballard, the ex-Homeland Security agent who actually risked his life. The left, on the other hand, wants to discredit him because they don't want this being talked about. See, I think that the left and the, these, these media outlets, they don't want to have a discussion that this film is going to compel. Yeah, I'll say they don't want this discussed. You know, this movie was held back for five years from being released because Hollywood wouldn't have it. A discussion about why 85,000 children showed up unaccompanied at the border and got released into the interior of a country that is uh, the highest consuming country for child exploitation material on the planet. It's just encouraging to me to see the forces of light actually winning some battles. Please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to be notified of more videos.